Today's highlight at the 2024 Smart City Summit and Expo is the essential role of global industry associations in fostering innovation. Away from the main exhibition hustle, international representatives share their wisdom on boosting industrial collaboration. I have seen that you guys have merging uh, combined two shows. One is an ESG, one is Smart City together. That's a great idea. Sometimes we are very focused Smart City, sometimes with technology, but ESG is a new trend. So you guys have tied up together and the people can see the whole picture in the future. But there is such value to coming and meeting people and shaking hands and having conversations and, and getting to exchange those ideas. You can see what's happening, you see what the trends are, you make those connections and then you bring that all back with you to help improve your communities. And at the end of the day, I believe that um, we have many things that we share in terms of common solutions and common problems as well. So if we can match the common solution and common problems, uh, we don't have to start from scratch. And that would actually take away some of the risk in terms of investments and actually uh, utilize, is what I just mentioned, the, the power of homo sapiens and collaborativeness. I, I think one, one of the unfortunate things about tech is that due to how quickly it's changing and constantly evolving, there is potential to leave certain peoples behind. And initiatives that can focus on going to those areas such as a rural community and making sure that they have the connectivity, you have to look at what their challenges are, which is gonna be different, and then try to use some of the lessons that maybe can actually be applied from these larger communities and bring them to these more rural areas. The middle of nowhere is no more. And what, the, what that means is the tools that exist now means that you can participate in that larger economy. I do believe that there are no formula to apply the whole smart city. Because it's smart, smart city is a uh, different nation, it's different countries, uh, different field, different thinking, different situation. So the, the number two is that learning everything, resources, urban learning, architect, whatever, we have to plan it. Number three, uh, everything has to get involved in the citizen and enterprises for long-term and short-term vision. You know, for long-term, it's a escape, but you know, all the government, they need a short-term result. So if we start with something that is, is immediately fulfilling the desi desire of the people whom we want to serve from the beginning, and we go from there to the point whereby the technology can actually work in the background and serve the people, I think we are getting to, 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 to the sweet spot uh, where technologies and desirability uh, meet. At the heart of the event, the Taiwan Smart City Summit and Expo stands as a catalyst for embracing transformative technologies, steering us towards a smarter world. This event acts as a vibrant arena where international thought leaders converge to share and mold the future of cutting-edge innovations. This is Huang Chi Ho for TVBS World Taiwan.